Disney's woke Indiana Jones 5 is already off to a horrible start as the reviews are starting to pour in. As you can see, it is already sitting at a 48% rotten, and this is coming from the woke critics. So you know that this film is already going to be a complete disaster, but now Harrison Ford is also stirring up the drama and is reacting to a lot of the stuff that is going on with this film. So we're going to get into that too because he has gotten very emotional about some of the response to the film. This whole thing is getting absolutely insane, and we also have very bad details about the film when it comes to the budget and potential box office numbers, which shows this film could be a complete flop. So Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny's huge budget could be fatal. Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny costs an exorbitant amount, and the movie's somewhat muted hype could see it lose money in the box office, which I completely believe is going to happen. And that is such a shame because this is the second franchise that Disney has screwed Harrison Ford on. Legacy franchises, huge franchises. This is absolutely pathetic and disgusting. Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny is the newest and final entry in the legendary movie franchise. This film costs $300 million to make. Coming in around $300 million, uh, uh, Dial of Destiny's budget is the biggest in the franchise. With the somewhat muted hype for the film and some controversy surrounding it, this gargantuan project budget may see Indy leaving theaters with a flop. What a shame. What an absolute absolute shame for such a fantastic character and story that has charmed audiences for generations. This is already showing that this is going to be, from a critical standpoint, probably the worst in the entire franchise. And now Harrison Ford has some reactions to everything that is going on as well. I just saw my life flash before my eyes. Harrison Ford gets emotional for Indiana Jones 5 as actor's final run gets disappointing response. During the premiere of the film, when the credits rolled, the cans audience performed a muted standing ovation for Harrison Ford's latest adventure in the film. The applause lasted for five minutes. And while we don't have tons of details about the film coming from Cannes, we do know that there's going to be a lot of cringe dialogue in this film and very woke, just ridiculous dialogue that doesn't make any sense whatsoever. And that is such a shame to see in the Indiana Jones franchise. I'm very touched. I'm very moved by it by this. Um, they say when you're about to die, you, <laughs> you see your life flash uh, before your eyes. And I just saw my life flash before my eyes. A great part of my life, but not all of my life. My life has been enabled by me. my lovely wife. How cool is that? That is just so awesome to see, and it's really cool to see that there's at least some people that honor Harrison Ford's legacy, even if Disney will not. And I'm grateful. And you know, um, I love you too. <laughs> Thank you. Anyway, so that's just really, really cool to see, and, uh, you know, he was definitely moved to tears by all of the positive response for him and his legacy, but it's going to be interesting to see what happens with this Indiana Jones 5 movie, man, because everything that we are seeing points it to it being a complete disaster, and that is such a disgusting, irresponsible mishandling by Disney, and it is such a pathetic thing that is happening, but with all that being said, let me know what you think about all of this in the comments below. What do you think about the upcoming Indiana Jones 5? What do you think is going to be the response and the outcome of that film? Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.